Let's, next question again, same question. Find the scalar that makes the vector v have a magnitude of 1. Let's kind of do the same thing, guys. Again, we're looking for this vector k. So let's go ahead and figure out the magnitude of v. That's going to be negative 5 squared plus 2 squared. And in this case, we get 29. So if my magnitude of this vector is 29, but I want to figure out what number should I multiply by so the magnitude would be 1. 1 over 29. 1 over 29. That's about as basic as we get. So k equals 1 over the square root of 29. So that is your vector k that makes it look like that. And let's just go ahead and see what that would look like. So, huh? Nope. So this vector, v, with k has a magnitude of uh, 1. And what that means is if you were to distribute that, since it has a magnitude of 1, which is kind of crazy, this is your point on the unit circle. Now, are we familiar with this point? No. No, we're not familiar with this point, right? Um, but again, let's kind of look at where this is. Negative 5, 2. That's over there, right? But again, so if you divide by the square root of 29, though, you'd get that point. But we're not familiar with that on the unit circle. So we're going to deal with that in just a second as far as what to do from there. But either way, to at least find 